previously on Hell's Kitchen All-Stars. Ah! Right. It's black jacket time. This is the day I've been waiting for. There were seven chefs remaining, but only five black jackets up for grabs. Two of you will be going home. In Chef Ramsay's first of three Black Jacket challenges, taste it, now make it. I gotta get this win. That's not how it is. That's fast. That's definitely not it. People spy in this kitchen. So I grabbed cauliflower to make them think I was doing it too. Millie came the closest to recreating Chef Ramsay's complex fish dish. The first person receiving a Black Jacket is Millie. Yes! Followed by Nick, amazing job. Earning them both access to the exclusive yeah. Black Jacket Lounge. <laughs> it's VIP. In the second challenge. Don't push. The remaining chefs had to race to grab ingredients. Wow. I'll take a week. Despite Jennifer's confidence. You guys are making this easy here. You're giving me good ingredients. Chef Ramsay wasn't impressed. Undercooked potato, no go. And Elise blew a great opportunity with her lobster as there was a fatal flaw. So it's got its shit sack there. They both came up short. And the third black jacket went to... Michelle. Yeah! 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 Season 14 right here! And jacket number four went to... Benjamin. Thank you, Chef. Everybody who has a black jacket right now is no joke. <laughs> Leaving Elise, Robin, and Jennifer to battle it out. Let's go. For the final black jacket and their lives in Hell's Kitchen. You have total freedom. It could be anything you want. Jennifer. Scallops, slightly undercooked in the center there. Wow. And Elise. Filet is not medium rare. Both had issues with their temperatures. I want to beat Elise so bad right now. While Robin left nothing to chance. It's melting in my mouth. Strong effort. And so the fifth and final black jacket went to. Robin. <sighs> Told you I was going to bring this, Mom. Ending Elise and Jennifer's dreams of becoming the head chef at Gordon Ramsay's Hell's Kitchen restaurant at Caesar's Palace in Las Vegas. And now, the continuation of Hell's Kitchen All Stars. Yeah! Good job, Robin. Fuck yeah. Good job, Robin. Thank you. I just gotta pinch myself. Like, I got goosebumps. Last two girls standing. How do we do, Robin? I'm going to sleep in this jacket tonight. I don't want to take it off. When you're calm and you're in control, you're at your best. Robin definitely had a rough start here in Hell's Kitchen second time around, but she's the comeback kid. I think she's definitely proving to be a, a serious competitor. I'm proud of all of us in this big, huge journey. We came together. This is the most intense shit that we've oh, yeah. ever done. Yeah. I was rooting for Elise, though. <sighs> <laughs> 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 Up. Oh my god! Oh. What the F is going on here? Good morning. It's a club. Chef Ramsay, we going to a rave? Ooh, ooh. Now, listen carefully. If you're going to be a head chef at Hell's Kitchen Las Vegas, I have to know that you can mentor, instruct, and teach a brigade. Yes, chef. So for today's challenge, you'll be tested on a very important and necessary skill. Your ability to teach. Seeing how this is an all-star season, I have for you some very incredible all-star students. Take it away. Wow. <laughs> it's lights going off everywhere. We got an announcer, like whatever it is, basketball, football, cooking, I'm ready to go. Cooking with Millie, he's a Heisman Trophy winner and in his first season with the Miami Dolphins, made the Pro Bowl and won NFL's leading rusher, it's Ricky Williams! Oh my god! Yeah! Damn! What? Yeah! Yeah, bro! Yeah. Let's go! Oh! Yes! 
cooking with Michelle. What? Winner of the 2016 WNBA Championship, Queen of the Hard Court, the Los what? Angeles Sparks own Candace Parker. <laughs> Hi. 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 Hello. Wow, you're really tall. <laughs> I was not an athletic child at all. I think the closest I got to a sport was in marching band. I don't even come under your shoulders. <laughs> it's okay. We'll make it good. <laughs> Cooking with Benjamin. He was 2005 Defensive Rookie of the Year. He was one of the top linebackers in the NFL. Oh you God. may know him as Lights Out, oh. Sean Merriman. Oh. 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 I fucking love you, man. Cooking with Nick. She was gold in gymnastics as a member of the Fierce Five. What? Jordan Weaver! Yes! I am so excited to be working with Jordan Weaver. How's it going? I'm a huge fan. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. She's an Olympian. She is a gold medalist. I mean, I think I'm pretty fucking awesome myself. So I think we're going to stick it today. And now, this Hall of Fame athlete is the Indiana Pacers' greatest player of all time. Please welcome five-time NBA All-Star, Reggie Miller! Oh, Reggie Miller, baby! Hey, how are you? This is crazy! Oh my god! All of you give a warm welcome to these incredible athletes. Oh We're gonna god. do this. We're gonna do this. Listen carefully, here's how today's challenge is going to work. You'll be instructing your all star partners how to execute the dish that each of you should know extremely well. Your Signature dish. <laughs> oh my god. I finally get to cook my signature dish. You know, it's the dish I had on my mind the moment I walked into Hell's Kitchen. That's when Chef Ramsay totally threw us a curveball. Lift your domes. That's not mine. What the fuck? This is not what I picked. This time, I think I'm gonna ace it. Now, your all star athletes will be doing all the cooking. What? Wow. Oh shit. You will not be allowed to touch. Anything. I'm gonna need some help. <laughs> you're good, you're good, I got you. You've got 45 minutes and your time starts now. Let's go. Let's go, into the kitchen. Let's go. Let's go. Follow you. Okay, we gotta hurry up. We gotta hurry up. All right. Get a couple of these little pots. You wanna get some water going? Grab a whisk out of that little. Yep. Is this a whisk? Yep. <laughs> Make sure it's in the center, because the pasta is gonna be expanded. There you go. Feel those super fast, 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 fast. Peel, peel, peel. Let your knife do all the work. You've not done it before. Is that your first time? First time. Wow. She's an Olympian, so I mean, <laughs> she, uh, let's be honest, she's, uh, yeah, she's fine. I never got to learn to cook. I spent my life in the gym, so. Yeah, exactly. So here, now's your chance. Yeah. I am just as nervous for no. this competition <laughs> as I am the Olympics. I feel like I'm doing surgery. Yeah, you got to like really get in there. I would rather do backflips on a four inch bounce beam than, um, <laughs> than test out my cooking skills. I'm like shaking right now. No, don't be. We're just chilling in the kitchen. OK. Is this right? Yep. Yeah, it's perfect. Oh, you're doing great, bro. I was so scared of this fucking dish. But now, <laughs> yeah, it, huh? uh, yeah, I feel great. That's enough. I'm a little intimidated by three dishes, but. No, but, I got you. Yeah. I got you. I promise you, I got you. Drop your fritter and then shake the basket at the like same this? time, y'all, so it don't stick. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. You got to be three dishes with one. I don't think they can do Candace it. Candace Parker can't tackle Ricky Williams. Reggie Miller can't tackle Ricky Williams. Sean Marion can't tackle Ricky Williams. So we straight. I know we're doing a lot, bro, but I appreciate it. Yeah. Just under 20 minutes to go. We just got 20 minutes. That's it. That's a we gotta quarter, go. man. We gotta... <laughs> you can win a championship in that time. I'm a huge NFL fan, so it's an honor to cook next to one of the most prolific linebackers in NFL history. This guy is a monster. So we need to chop up some butter, so take the butter out. Okay. Sean Marion, man. He was checking himself out. He's making sure he still looked good, you know? You're doing perfect. Yeah, you're, so, you got, oh you're God, working on sweat. sweat. He's a good looking guy, so it's kind of distracting. Sure, we're good? And we're good. We're looking good. We've worked up a sweat Excellent. down here. I mean, Nick was checking him out. I don't know who Benjamin's cooking with, but um, damn, that ass, though. Eight minutes, guys. Oh, we say walking through the kitchen hot, hot. Hot, hot, walking through the kitchen, hot, hot. Hot, hot, what, what? Hot what, what? what, what, what? It's what? getting hot in here. It's getting hot in here. Oh, right here. Oh, yeah, go, go, come on. Don't focus on them. That's what we're going to do, psych them out. Fade. Uh, 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 uh. I've only been in the kitchen with Reggie for five minutes, and it feels like I've been in the kitchen with him for 10 years. We're just vibing. Yeah. That's it. 
That's called, we're making them blister. Yeah, we're making them a blister, like baby. What? Oh, my. We're, we're making a tomato blister, blister, blister over, here. over here. Excuse me. I'm sorry, so a score is like you're just barely marking it. See, they're so focused. I know. All those other athletes, y'all going down. This is the team right here. There's no comparison. You can't even touch us. High and wide. High and wide. Excellent. Twelve o'clock. One o'clock. One o'clock. Give each of them a tap, tap. Tap, 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 tap. Robin and Reggie maybe should focus more on the searing of the scallops as opposed to your dance move. Because we're focusing on our sea bass. We're focused That's on we're everything doing. right now. It's on the whole plate. Yeah. We'll dance later when we win. Yes. So use the fish spatula to kind of press it down, but lightly. Don't press it down so too hard. like that. Yep. We're going to dribble around this kitchen right now. And hit threes. And hit threes. And half court shots. And half court shots. Yeah. Whatever that be. <laughs> See that one's getting golden brown, so let's flip that one first. Ooh, that's hot. It is hot. Ah. Don't be scared. You're not gonna get burnt. All right. Oh, we doing it over here. Oh yeah, we're doing it. We're not even sweating over here. We're not even nervous. Flip it, like just like that. <laughs> it is so hot. Are we sweating? It is sweating over here, girl. Just over three minutes, guys. Now we're gonna smoke these babies. Look at that shit. That's crazy. Look so at that. They just made smoke. Mom's gonna be impressed, and I know how to base. I know. Oh my god. It's good. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Now we cook it. Time to plate, guys. Right on top. Right on top. Ten. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Nine. Do a drizzle around it. Eight. Perfect. Seven. That's beautiful. Six. Five. That's perfect. Four. Come on, come on, come on. Three, two, one, and stop. Well done, guys. In today's All-Star Cook-Along Challenge, the chefs are teaching athletes, WNBA superstar Candace Parker. Oh, we doing it over here. Oh, yeah, we doing it. NBA legend we Reggie Miller. Olympic gold medalist Jordan Weber. Not too bad so far, right? No, it's easy. All right, good. You got this. And NFL All-Stars, Sean Merriman. That's yep. perfect. And Ricky Williams. That's beautiful. Some all-star moves of their own. Three, two, one. One, and stop. Well done, guys. Now, here's how it's going to work. For today's judging, I'm going to taste the first dish, and that all-star team will then take a place in those chairs as king of the hill. The duo that are still sitting after all the tastings will win this challenge. Right, first up, Nick and Jordan. Let's go. We're going to bring it. Good luck, y'all. I'm super nervous to go <laughs> approach Chef Ramsay. I know he's a little bit intimidating, right. and I don't know if he's going to yell at me or not. <laughs> Right, uh, Jordan, describe your dish, please. So we have um, the <laughs> you got it. <laughs> celery root puree, and we have peppercorn crusted scallops. The actual cook on the scallops is delicious. Good job, Jordan. <laughs> I just wish we could get cook on the scallop like that in service. <laughs> do you cook often? I do not, no. <laughs> really? I'm pretty good at scrambled eggs, but that's about it. <laughs> you may want to consider another career here. <laughs> Great start. Both Thank you. Well done. You. Please job, take a seat. Next up, Robin and Reggie. Let's go. Good luck, y'all. We look good. We look good. We cook well. And we're going to win this thing. Reggie, describe the dish, please. This is seared scallops in a uni sauce. Pasta's cooked. Excellent. It's fresh, it's clean, and it's vibrant. But for me, the hero of this is the scallops. Each and every one of them being seared nice. beautifully. You said it. You so, said it. You said it. Tough one. We had more scallops. We only have three or four scallops, so. I mean, I could do four scallops in my sleep. But I love the competitive spirit, Reggie. Um, does it outshine Nick and Jordan? Yes, it does outshine. Yeah! OK! Please take a seat. Oh, um, oh, my goodness. Sorry, Nick and Jordan, but this throne is now ours. Are you kidding me? We are now the king, king of the, the hill. Bye-bye. Nice job, boss. <laughs> right, uh, next up, Millie and Ricky. Let's go. We got sea bass three ways. Three delicious ways. I mean, I I'm telling you, when you taste each one, taste buds explode, I, I, don't, I don't see how we can lose at all. So describe this, please. We wanted to take sea bass and do it different ways. So here we have a fritter. We have the pan-seared sea bass with the risotto. And over here, we have poached sea bass on a, a fennel and apple salad. Right. Love the risotto and the sea bass. Um, love the fritter. So, does it beat Robin and Reggie? 
Yes, it does. Yes. Congratulations. Yes. Wow. Yes. Well done, guys. Yes. Yeah. Hell yeah. Get up out of here, Robin and Reggie. Bye-bye. And, -bye. and you can't put your leg out on this one, Reggie. No fouls. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, up next, Michelle and Candice, please. Excuse me. Bring it home, Excuse Candace. Bring it home. Excuse Bring it home, Candice. She just straight elbowed me. All right, we have a pasta tossed in uni sauce, seared sea bass, and miso beet puree. Great color on the skin here. Love that. Sea bass is cooked to perfection. That is beautiful. But does it beat Millie's? It's a tough one. Um, I'd like Michelle and Candice to take a seat, please. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Nice. <laughs> Good job. Last one. Let's go. Benjamin and Sean. Oh, yeah, it's game time. It's on. We want to win. That's I right. Mean, I know Sean wants to win. I want to win. They are going down. Thank you. He's a really good competitor, so let's see. Right, uh, Sean, what was it like cooking in Hell's Kitchen? It was a workout. I was in there sweating the whole time, and I looked over and I seen Reggie. I said, OK, he's sweating more than me, so I'm not that bad out of shape. Describe the dish, please. So we got a smoked lamb loin and roasted cauliflower. Oh, wow. A lamb's cooked beautifully. Let's get that right. Inside is uh, pink. Sean's nickname, as you know, is Lights Out. Is it going to be Lights Out for Michelle and Candace? That's a really tough one. Um, the dish is not as good as Michelle and Candace's. Yeah! Congratulations. <laughs> we won. Yes! Yay, we won! Woo! We gotta, we gotta hit the, like this? and then okay. the spoon. On the spoon, yeah, okay. <laughs> Candice, Reggie, Jordan, Sean, and Ricky, thank you so much. Best wishes and continued success. It's nice meeting you. Good job. Thank you. Best of luck to you guys. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah. You see that one coming this morning, did you? No. <laughs> what a turnout of athletes. Michelle, I have an amazing day for you. You're going to be treated to the most amazing, breathtaking views of downtown Los Angeles. Oh. All from your very own helicopter. <laughs> now, once you've flown high above the sky, get ready to die in the clouds at 71 above. <laughs> a restaurant that is 1,000 feet above the ground. Wow. Oh, my god. This reward is so special that it shouldn't be experienced alone. Take a moment. Nick, chef. Thanks, Michelle. You're welcome, Nick. Michelle, Nick, your chopper is taking off soon. Congratulations. Thank you. Ooh, Nick, come on. <laughs> of course I was going to pick you. <laughs> oh, my god. Yay! <sighs> Today in Hell's Kitchen, it is deep cleaning day. Oh. Our red carpet's taking a beating. So, brush, brush, brush. Make sure there's not an ounce of dirt anywhere. Got me? Yes, yes, sir. Chef. yes chef. Please jump back in the kitchens. Off you go. Oh, man. They're getting a ride around in a helicopter. But I will never forget this day because we got a chance to teach all star athletes how to cook in the kitchen with us. This is the real deal. Listen, if I'm going to clean up your kitchen and you leave some food over, thank you for the gift. I just had some of your lamb. I got to sample almost everybody's dish. Oh, that's all that. Candace Parker, you killed that dish. Y'all deserve the win. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Oh my God, look Woo. at this helicopter. Oh my God, that's crazy. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for taking me. I'm so nervous. Heights and me do not go well together, so good thing I'm wearing an extra pair of underwear. <laughs> Ready, Nick? I'm so nervous. No, no, no I'm excited, nervous, excited, excited, nervous, excited, excited, nervous. Ah, we're floating. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Oh, my God. Ah! Oh, look at the Hollywood Oh, my God, it's right there. Oh, that's cool. Hey, Kim Kardashian. Hey, Beyonce. Oh, hey, Britney Spears. I'm glad I'm conquering my fears. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, uh, there's so many buildings. That's stunning. Someone as pretty as me. Beautiful. Welcome to 71 and Bob. Thank, Thank you. you. Follow me. Oh, I'm so excited. Things I never thought I'd be doing, taking a helicopter and looking at this view right now. Yeah. Oh, my god. Thank you so much. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's like off the cover of a magazine. Doesn't it? We're here again, black jackets. Last time, I don't think we were ready. I think this time, it's our time. I think it's the final two. I yeah. really do. 
Nick and I do have a special bond. We shared season 14 together, those experiences, and we've kept that friendship throughout this season. He's like my right-hand man, and he's definitely got my back. Backing this shows how saying. immature you Your are. numbers ain't backing up shit. Elise, you're a fucking bully. And I'm not even talking to you. Fine, check the scoreboard. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. I would rather spend this lunch with him than anyone else in Hell's Kitchen. Cheers to the final two. Yes. Cheers to the youngest chefs, and I hope the old geriatrics are having fun back in Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> geriatrics, bye. <laughs> um, Millie from Philly, could you carry that back there? No. Why me? Because you got muscles, and I don't. <laughs> nah. If we get paid the same amount, we got to do the same job. Ow. Real shit. That's how, that's how I look okay. at it. Mix. Millie from Philly. Mainly over you eating fucking strips and Wellingtons and lambs when we're cleaning up the kitchen and you let everyone else clean up. Do you think you're too good to clean? Because I think you do. You guys want to empty this for me? <sighs> okay, I'll figure it out. You think you can help me, really? Or is that too much work for you as well? Like, come on now. Why are you doing that rug again? <laughs> Why are you doing that spot again? Are you gonna get down there and scrub it too? No, 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 no. Come on, Robin. I don't need no more aggravation. I'm already out here cleaning carpets all day. Just leave me alone. Blah, 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 blah. Fucking clean, bitch. Clean. Instead of fucking talking. With Michelle and Nick back from an afternoon high above Los Angeles. We need to get in there and set up. The final five chefs are preparing for their first dinner service together in one kitchen. Let's rock out, guys. Boom, boom, boom. That's boom, good. Guys. Everybody ready? Anybody missing anything? Are you ready? Yes. Yes, chef. Yep. Yes, chef. Yep. Nick. Yeah. I need some help setting up. What? Can you finish my beef tartare? I'm, I need, um. What do you need? I still need more coupon. Millie is looking super flustered already, and that's not a good sign. And I need this. This is what I need. He definitely isn't set up, and it's not fair to be relying on me. What did I use papers for? Papers, beef tartare. Tart -tart. Yeah, with shallots and then cornichons. And I said to you, are you ready? I said, are you ready? And you're like, yeah, yeah. I'm Didn't sorry, you say that to me? Focus, yeah? One and a half scallops, three slices, yes? Yes, chef. Good. Wellington's glazed, yes? Yes, chef. Bacon rendered, yeah? Yes, chef, right here. A couple orders to start. Eyes wide open, yes? Yes, yes chef. wide open, chef. Mourinho. See you, chef. Open house kitchen, please. Let's go. So be done. The excitement in Hell's Kitchen tonight is palpable. Good. Have a great evening as guests have secured one of the hottest reservations in Los Angeles. Oh, man, look at this place. Af no, ladies uh, first, ladies first. Oh, oh it's cool, you got the black jackets today. For the first time, the All-Stars will be serving the entire dining room out of one kitchen. We got this tonight. No nerves. No nerves at all. All right. Including one very special chef's table. To Hell's Kitchen, let's get it. Salud. Salud. Now bring the steak. Why Clef John has got two pretty ladies with him, so that always helps. Let's go. Come on, bro. Order off my station so I can show off. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Two tall tall one risotto, one carbonara, and I want two cured salmon. Yes, yes chef. chef. Come on, Millie, let's go. Can't stop, won't stop. You already know what it is. I'm from Philly. I'm turned up on cold ass and how to whip, whip, whip. I need some more pans already. Fuck. Oh, my God. We just started dinner service, and Millie Station is just a friggin' mess. There's food all over the range. If I saw that as a diner, I'd be like, I'm gonna pass, cause it looks like someone just took a shit on your station, so I'm, I'm good with that, thank you. Hey, pan's burning. Burn pan, I don't got no fucking burn pan. Oh my God. Millie, start again. Yes, sir. I felt I want to clean down a little bit. Yes, sir. We're working a mess, we produce a mess. We work clean and tidy. And we produce immaculate food, OK? Yes, chef. Like, cooking is an art. You got to love it. My favorite, that I'm a master, boiled eggs. Robin, help with the two tartare now, please. Yes. Nick, start two cured salmon, please. Yes, chef. Um, Robin. Yes. After that, uh, I'm going to ask Nick, I'm going to ask Nick to uh, jump on the tartare. What's going on right now? Millie's got a lot of people helping him. Nick is helping him. Robin's helping him. There's like three people on the app station right now. Walking behind cured salmon to the pass. 
Hey, Millie, we're in full flight service now. We can't do any more work for you, OK? Yes, sir. One minute. I need to plate that, though, Millie. Yes, sir. Walking carbonara right now. Yeah, I'm not worried about nothing at this point. Sign, sell, deliver. Millie is going to serve it, and it's going to be perfect. Carbonara. Millie. Millie. Delicious. Thank you, sir. Dun, 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 dun. Nick, yes, chef. on to the meat now. Yes, chef. Millie can do a tartare and a risotto at the same time. Yes, if he can't, it shouldn't be here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Service, please. Thank you. Oh, that looks oh, insane. Yeah. Really that is really it's good. so good, right? Can I go with two lobster waves and two ducks? Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Six yes. minutes to the window. Yes. When I'm in the kitchen, I am calm, focused. I'm always paying attention. I'm watching, and, you know, I get shit done. How long do you need? How long, Benjamin? Benjamin, talk to fucking Robin. How long to duck? No, I need the countdown. Benjamin, I'm not exactly sure how old you are. I don't know if you're 40 or 50, mid-50s, but you need to find your voice. The clock is ticking. The nursing home's around the corner, buddy. You two need to join together. Yes. Five, four, three, two, one. It's not fucking funny, guys. My back's turned. There's no countdown. Two minutes, two lobsters, two duck. Hurry. Thank one you. One minute to the window, Benjamin. Okay, I'm slicing lobster. Couscous is right here. Hey, 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 come here, all of you. This is where the wheels come off. Just taste that. It's not a little bit of salt, it's fucking bland. disgusting. Yes. This couscous is so bland, it's almost as bland as Benjamin's personality. Show a bit of respect. Yes, chef. A little bit of respect. Who in the right mind is going to serve that shit? Answer me. You don't play. This is crazy. No, just answer me. It's over 45 minutes into the All-Stars' first Black Jacket dinner service. Hey, 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 hey. Just taste that. It's not a little bit of salt. It's fucking Land. disgusting. Yes. And Robin's underwhelming couscous has Chef Ramsay asking... Who in the right mind is going to serve that shit? That's my question to you. Just answer me. I don't have an answer for you, Chef. Guys, taste everything. Just give me the best, Robin, please. Couscous, two minutes. Everyone chill out. Pump the brakes, like, pump, pump, pump. I'm going to get this. Coming down, pass. Welcome and garnish. Put it down and fuck off. Yes, Chef. Delicious. Thank you, Chef. Service, please. Oh, yeah. That's really good. Away next, two lobster, two beef wellington, one New York strip. All meat heavy, guys. All meat heavy, OK? Yes, Chef. Five minutes to the window. Yes, Chef. Hey, hey. You have to turn back, call back, and refresh each other's memory. You're not doing it, Ben. We, yeah. Chef. Great. Here we go again. For the fourth time tonight, I need a voice now. Yeah. We, Chef. You're in control. We, Chef. Man, Benjamin, I'm going to keep it real with you. You've never been to France. You're not French. You're Irish. Where the fuck is this we chef coming from? We chef, we chef. I could wee wee and parlez vous français, like voulez vous vous avec quoi, like I could do that shit all day. But guess what? No, stop speaking French and speak some fucking English. Where's the momentum? Count back, let's go. Three and a half, four, let's go. We chef. You're just saying yes in fucking French. Like just because you say we oui doesn't mean you have a voice, okay? Just letting you know. Hey, come here, quickly. I turn my back and there's no countdown. And I'm getting zero feedback. Yes, it's the last time I'm telling you. Yes, chef. Last time. Yes, chef. Got it? Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Robin, one minute to the window. Two beef, two lobster. Yes. Followed up by one New York strip. Chef has an expectation for me to take control and just prove that I belong here. 30 seconds to the pass. Let's go, Benjamin. Push, please. Let's go. Benjamin, you want to stay here to the end? Well, you better fucking find your voice and take control. Walking garnish right now. Walking. Slicing Wellington. Here you go, chef. One New York strip, yes? The right side, chef. Two beef, two lobster, chef. Service, please. The beef wellington is amazing. This is so good. Oh, my goodness. Excellent job. On order, VIP chef's table. One halibut, one New York strip, one pork. Yes, chef. Five minutes, Michelle. Five minutes on halibut. Perfect. Keep up this pace. Nick and I are strong competitors, and now we're in black jackets. This is what we've been working for since we've gotten here. Can you go in two minutes? Thanks for asking. 
You know, I think we really need to give Chef Ramsay a really good service. Chef Halibut. Get those garnishes up. Garnish is walking right now. Oh, let's go, Robin. Come on, speed Walk. it up. I'm slicing. Halibut sauce. Halibut sauce. Halibut sauce, anybody? Sorry, uh... Chef. Guys, think about the dishes we're doing. Come on, we know this stuff. Let's go. Walking sirloin. Michelle, I love you. You and I are holding it down right now, but as our buddy Wyclef Jean at our chef table would tell you, you're killing us softly with this sauce. Nick, come on, guys. Hey, all of you. Hey, just come here. Nick, we've been on point. It's undercooked. It's three minutes away from yes, there. Chef. Get yes, it chef. back in. Yes, chef. OK. Damn it, I'm not fucking up the whole table. I can't. Face. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. I was having a perfect flawless service until just now. Where's the new old service right for the chef table? Yes, chef. Take it over, Nick, please. Yes, chef. Here's this New York strip for you. I'm sorry about that. Okay. I hope this is better for you, okay? All right, thank you How so much. How is everything else so far? Incredible. Good, good to hear. Everybody enjoy your meal. On order, hey, one six top. It's two pork, two beef wellington, two lamb. Yes, yes chef. chef. Robin, that means you're four minutes to the pass. Hold on. How long? One second. I need more pots and pans, guys. You need to get, you need to get that table going. Yeah. Benjamin, are you so down because of her? Yes no, or no? No. Yes, chef. Uh, yes? Yeah. I'm sorry, guys. I'm in the weeds right now. I apologize. Don't apologize. Just bounce back. back. The yeah. fennel's heating up right now. Robin, get up salmon garnish first. Robin. Could you stop calling stuff at me? Let me focus real quick. Please. Take a breath. I am getting my ass pounded tonight. Like pounded, 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 pounded. Robin, can you walk garnish, please? Hold on. I'm ready now. We're ready to go. OK. Hi, new. Pork. Chef, this is just, just stop talking to me. Give me the fucking garnish. I don't like this. I want to put new ones down. Oh, my God. Hey, 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 all I of you, come here. I don't want to send that. Yeah, just come, come here. Hey, hey, I'm, 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 all of you, come this. here. Chef, I told you I didn't want to send that. I'm sorry if you misunderstood me. What did you just say to me? Where did they go? I told you I didn't want to send that. I'm sorry if you misunderstood me. What did you just say to me? Robin, you do not want to get in Chef Ramsay's way. If you get in his way, it's going to be like running the balls in Spain, and you're going to lose. So what I didn't want to send that. Is this? Overcooked Brussels sprouts. Chef Ramsay is pissed because Robin's Brussels sprouts look like rabbit turds. Sorry, Chef. I missed change the wrong path. <sighs> Come on, Robin. Bounce back, Refire it, okay? I feel like I just got a beat down, but you know what? I am not going down like this. Robin, you're good. Come on. I got it. I got it. Behind, there you go, chef. Let's go. John, you know where we're going, yes? It's really good. It's great. Fabulous. Too. Last table, let's go. One pork, one yule trick, one halibut, one crispy salmon. Yes, yes chef. chef. I can get this up in four minutes, okay? Sure. Heard. Let me know when I can run. Walk now. Go with garnish. Garnish coming to the window, chefs. Walking right now. Behind you. Service, please. Oh, my god. Good? Mm -hmm. I'm full. Service off, please, Nick. Well done. Man, I'm going to sleep like a baby. Line up. Let's go. Right, uh, first of all, well done. You served the entire dining room faster and with more quality than we have with both kitchens all year. But there were bumps and problems on stations, yes? Yes, yes chef. chef. So, Michelle, you're the only one with a flawless service. What I want you to do right now is to have a one-on-one -on -one chat and decide on two nominees. And get out of here. Yes, Chef. I was not expecting that. Oh, my god. It's a tough position for me, but I have to decide who would we be stronger without. Just get your spiels ready, I guess. I don't know what else to say. I'll go talk to you, can I go? Yeah, let's go. OK, so I'm just going to ask each of you two questions. Why do you deserve to stay in Hell's Kitchen? So I didn't make any mistakes tonight. I think it's really important to be able to acknowledge your own weaknesses. Chef Ramsay had to push you, you know what I mean? That's what I saw. Michelle, the only reason you'd want to put me up for elimination right now is because you don't want to compete against me. It'd be purely a strategy thing. But you know, I'm hoping that you want to compete against the best. What's the next question? So what do you think your weaknesses are? Well, I don't know. I'm one of the best cooks here. 
Benjamin is not being completely honest with his weaknesses. Okay, thank you. I think he can be a little bit cocky, so he should have been more vocal. He should have been driving from the beginning, and he should have stepped up to the plate, and he didn't. Millie, you want to go? You want to go? Sorry, Benjamin. Sorry, Robin. Sorry, Nick. Nobody was perfect tonight on their station. It comes down to the least mistakes, and I had the least. So it's only right that I don't get picked. I really don't care what nobody say about me. I really think I deserve to be here, and you've been seeing great finesse. So what do you think your weaknesses are? I need to learn more technique in certain areas. You had, a, like, a burned pan, too, didn't you? That was my biggest mistake tonight, not changing my carbonara from a, a dirty pan to a clean pan. Did you see his station tonight? That's bad. That's bad. Basically, all he cooked tonight was fucking risotto and fucking carbonara. I did all the cured salmon. I did the fucking four tartars. Yep. We were doing his cold apps. You ready, girl? I am not the weakest person here, and I don't want another fucking repeat of season 10 when I get my black jacket for one day and then I go home. I don't want that. I'm asking everyone, what are your weaknesses? Sometimes when I get frazzled, I get in my head. Like when everyone was screaming at me today, yeah. I need everyone to shut the fuck up, and I yeah. need to focus on one person. Yeah. I don't even know why Robin would have showed Chef Ramsay that pan. She's like, I'm not the weakest one here, and I'm like, you're trying to convince yourself you're not the tightest one. I feel like Millie's definitely weaker than me. And Benjamin, he doesn't communicate. Yeah. That's my spiel. All right. I don't know. Everyone is fighting for their life, for sure. There's three really good choices for me right now. What up? This is awkward. Yeah. What are your strengths and what are your weaknesses? I know this is a competition, Michelle, but you better not fucking put me out, you little bitch. I'll be so pissed at you. I'm just kidding. <laughs> what a night. Michelle, first nominee and why, please? The first nominee is Robin. I think Robin should have been more comfortable with herself today on the garnish station. She should have been more familiar with it. Second nomination and why? Um. Um. Michelle, first nominee. Uh, Chef, the first nominee is Robin. Second nomination and why? Um, the second nomination is Millie, Chef. Millie had a lot of help tonight. He should have been more confident and familiar on a station. Robin, Millie, step forward, please. Millie, why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? I've improved on finesse and breaking out of my mold. I'm going to turn up every time I'm on the station. I turned up garnish. I turned up meat Asian night. I turned up hot ads two times. Tell me when I went down on the station. Yeah, everyone is to hold you up. Like, like a team. That's why you're not going down. Yeah, shut you're, up, Garnish. You're a better chef than me? You went down on Garnish. And I admitted that I was going down. You went down on meat last time. You tripping. I'm tripping. The first time you were on the station, you went down. Every time you was okay. on the station with somebody yep. else, you did good. Robin, why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? I have not given up. I have more to show you. No matter what, when I was crashing and burning, I was fighting throughout the whole time. I didn't give up. And the biggest thing in the kitchen is admitting when you can ask for help. I said I was drowning, I needed help. But Millie, you don't help out when people ask help. So You're if I need a liar. To I'm Everybody not a liar. you never even said that about me ever in life. Really? You're a liar. I'm a liar? I see how it is while you're sitting there eating lamb chops, getting sparkling water. I'm sitting there busting shit out. Get out my face. Y'all y'all judging me on something else, and it ain't got nothing to do with cooking. You tripping. I don't say nothing else to me. And this is why I don't ever want to speak to you, because you get so angry. Ellie, calm down. You're a liar. Don't say nothing else to me. I ain't judging you on nothing. Don't say nothing else to me. Enough, 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 enough. Both of you. Millie, Robin, stop it. They should hand you your red jacket back. Enough. Right there. My decision is... Millie, come here. Yes, sir. Listen carefully. Yes, sir. Get back in line. Robin, thank you, sir. Robin, come here. Yes, chef. At the beginning of this competition, you almost left. Yes, chef. And since that moment, you turned it around. You found your voice. But you're not ready to be my head chef in Vegas. All right, chef, I appreciate the opportunity coming back here in Hell's Kitchen again. I don't want your jacket. Keep hold of it. Thank you, chef.
Thank you. Get out of there. Robin. Robin. Come here. Bye, guys. Love you. Keep your head up. Always. I'll see you on the street, Millie. I did not think this is how it was gonna end for me, but you know what? I have absolutely no regrets leaving Hell's Kitchen tonight. I gave him my all. Who cooked the lobster Wellington? Robin did, Chef. Yeah, beautiful. Fuck yeah! I was rocky when I started. One out of five. It was disgusting. Fuck. Wake up! Yeah, Chef! Get out! But no matter what, at least I know I put my heart in the plate. The winner of this challenge would be, I think, Robin. Robin, three for four, great job. At least I know I went down fighting. Who does this belong to? <gasps> Congratulations. Well done. Thanks, Chef. Yes, Robin! <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm a strong personality. Way to bounce back after two shitty challenges. Thank you, that's right, because I'm the bounce back queen. But in that kitchen? Strip, cod, soul, lamb. Strip, cod, soul, lamb. 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 Did you always have fun? Fire. <laughs> it's not the end of me. We're free! Me and my pet rock, Herbie, we're gonna be just fine. One thing I do know for sure is I definitely have the right final four chefs. Now it's gonna get even harder. Get some rest. Yes, chef. Yes, Thank chef. you, chef. Thank you, chef. Oh my gosh, it feels so good to be in the final four. Last girl standing. <laughs> Focus is definitely the key word moving forward. I just need to keep my eye on that prize. I hope Millie brushes that off the shoulders, because... That was too much, man. I think it's super unprofessional the way Millie is acting. You can't run a kitchen or a business acting like that. If tonight was any indication how the rest of this competition is going to go, I definitely have this in the bag. Robin, you'll see me in the street. If you do something to me in the street, I'm calling the cops on your crazy ass. That's what you want to take it to? Oh, I know why. Because you can't see me in the fucking kitchen. Bye, girl. I've always admired Robin's no-nonsense attitude. But tonight, she had the wrong attitude and served up a lot of nonsense. Next time on Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> Will an emotional surprise from Chef Ramsay? <laughs> I have pictures of my nephews and I look at them every night. Huh. Give the final four chefs a much needed second win. Daddy gonna win for you. Oh my God, he's so cute. <laughs> or will it create such a frenzy to win? This is the biggest dinner service of my life. That it turns one chef into an unbearable diva. What is this? Bag is fucked. Let's go, Millie. I'm not asking for much. Will he force his closest ally? Come on, Michelle. Pick up the speed. It's not hot. I need that Jew right now. To become his newest enemy. Michelle. Yes, Chef. I need lamb sauce. This is duck sauce. Oh, my bad. Come on, Michelle. Seriously? It's the night they've all been waiting for. The first chef into the finale is... And it's all next time on Hell's Kitchen All-Stars.